गुड मॉर्निंग डियर स्टूडेंट्स इन आई एम वंदना पई इन टूडेज लेक्चर ऑफ सब्जेक्ट ग्लोबल फाइनेंस पेपर वन वी विल बी डिस्कसिंग द कंटेंट मोटिवेशन फॉर इंटरनेशनल बिजनेस ओके मीन्स वॉट आर द डिफरेंट मोटिव्स थ्रू विच यू कैन स्विच ओवर टू टूवर्ड्स इंटरनेशनल बिजनेस ओके लेट सी वॉट आर द डिफरेंट मोटिव्स or what is the motivation through which you can switch over towards international business or as an businessman okay what are the things what are the factors which okay um, induce a particular businessman to be or to carry international business okay let's see so there are in total 10 motives through which you can switch over towards international business okay what are this motives let's see first one increase sales and profitability okay increase sales and profitability what is this okay see at a local level all in the home country usually okay you will be getting limited sales and limited profit profitability okay but whenever we think about international market okay whenever we think about international market surely it will be helpful for you to increase the sales okay to increase the sales because in home market in home market or in local market usually okay there might be different competitors there might be uh, n number of competitors okay due to this due to this okay your sales will not be that effective your sales will be not that to mark okay it will be not uh, the expected sales okay the expected sales or the sales for which you have planned for okay that planning will not be achieved in the local market but whenever we switch over towards international market okay what will happen yes surely whatsoever you have whatsoever you have manufactured whatsoever you have produced into your organization into your business surely it will be sold in the international market okay now next thing okay if there is appropriate sales surely yes you will earn good amount of profit okay the profit which you have planned for so okay the first motive itself is okay if you want to increase the sales of your business okay and if you want to earn maximum profit amount okay then what you can do is you can go international okay this is the first motive which usually motivates the businessman to select the option of international business okay because previously they might be um, okay uh, their organization sales might not be adequate or the profit which they were earning through their business it was not adequate so due to this due to this itself okay what they might have done okay they might have switch over towards international business or what they can do is they can switch over towards international business okay the second motive second motive of the international business is enter new markets okay enter new markets what is enter new markets okay see uh, yes you you might be successful at local market okay then you might have switch over or expanded your business towards the state market okay then you might have okay switch over towards national markets or you might have is it um you might have increased your sales or expanded the scope of your business towards another states okay now okay through um through your efforts what you can do okay you can enter into new markets or you can enter into boundaries of new countries okay or foreign countries okay due to this what will happen yes due to this what will happen yes okay the new market 
will give you new opportunity and that new opportunity will surely prove to be strength of your organization is it okay so uh, entering into new market itself can be a motive towards international business third one is create job okay see whenever we establish any business we do create employment opportunities right okay even though you establish a small business still you give employment opportunities to at least 10 to 15 people okay now if you switch over to international market see what will be the scope of your business it will be international okay now whenever we think about international business or international market okay and whenever you try to be successful in international business you need to hire few people right you need to hire few people okay in this way in this way you create employment opportunities as well as you create jobs to many more surely it will be beneficial for the country itself because you shoulder a responsibility related to yes controlling one of the problem which is prevailing into the country that is unemployment so if you want to create jobs okay or creating the jobs itself can be one of the motive for international business then offset slow growth in your home market okay see whenever we had started the discussion itself okay in the first point itself okay we have readily discussed that okay see whenever we consider the local market okay whenever we consider the local market we might be having okay tough competition in the local market because each producer has the same product is it and each producer or each manufacturer manufacturer they will strive harder to sell their products is it okay so okay what about your sales okay what about the products of your business yes the expected profit okay or the normal profit even the, uh, you have to strive harder for getting the normal profit also okay so there might not be uh, okay the expected growth okay the expected growth of your business it might not be achieved at the local markets so okay if we go international then what will happen yes what will happen surely it will be helpful for you as well as your business to progress okay so somewhere somewhere it will be helpful to ensure the economic growth also is it then avoid competitors avoid competitors what is this okay now whenever we think about our product okay there might be so many competitors who are prevailing into your same product line is it if you are ma manufacturing a soap okay whenever we consider soap industry there are many more competitors into this product line right okay now okay if we take any another product if we take any another product surely there will be perfect competition into that product line right okay now if we want to prove a competitive age if we want to enjoy a competitive advantage over other competitors okay if we switch over to international market yes if we switch over towards the international business what will happen yes no one from your competitors or few competitors they might have selected this option okay or if no of your uh, competitor they have selected no one from your competitor they have selected this international business option then what will happen yes it will surely give you a competitive edge right okay so to avoid competition to overcome competition itself 
can be one of the motive towards switching over towards the international business okay then enlarge the customer base enlarge the customer base yes customer is the king of market is it okay nowadays customer is treated as king of the market okay why because in modern times whenever we consider the business in modern times whenever we consider the business at the time customer satisfaction itself is the basic or main objective of the business right okay now previously previously okay whenever you were in the local market whenever you are marketing your product in the local market is it you were supposed to strive harder okay to reach to satisfy the customer is it but whenever you go international okay you create your brand image okay and through that brand image okay how the brand image is created yes okay because whenever we will be focusing on the international business yes you will ensure quality into your product right because unless until you have superior quality of product or perfect product you can't switch over towards the international market is it okay inferior quality of product inferior quality product will never be entertained by the international business or international market is it so you will create your brand okay surely it will uh, help you to gather or enlarge number of customers okay then create economies of scale in production okay create economies of scale in production okay economies of scale means what okay enjoy the availability of resources enjoy the availability of resources yes okay if you want to continue the uh, manufacturing activity is it or if you want to commence the manufacturing or the production activity yes you are in need of resources is it okay now if you are one from the public if you are one from the public or you are one from the general public surely whenever the supplier is providing you with the raw materials or resources they will think and rethink okay but if you have marked your presence if you have marked your your presence or if you are different from the public if you are different from the mob is it yes as you have switch over to as international business you are different than others right okay so surely the suppliers of raw materials and other stakeholders they will be interested to provide you with resources okay maybe the physical resources or maybe the financial resources is it so it will be helpful for you to create economies of scale in production okay whatsoever you need to okay complete the production activity that will be readily made available to you because you are going international and international business will surely lead you towards profitability and all the people all the stakeholders okay right from the suppliers to the customers is it they will get their expected interest right then explore the untapped markets with the power of the internet okay what is explore untapped markets with the power of the internet okay now many of the parts of the world is it they might be ignored they might be ignored by some of the competitors is it now in the international market also in the international market also okay there might be some of the competitors okay now this competitors they might have focused on some of the uh, is it um, markets of the developed co- countries only okay to earn maximum profit they might have focused on the markets of the developed countries only now what about under developed countries or developing countries yes you can focus on those areas or 
those countries or those places which might be ignored by your competitors okay focusing on these markets surely it will lead your organization your business towards maximum profit okay so exploring the untapped markets as it can also be a motive towards the international business then make use of excess capacity of season okay excess capacity of season what is it okay now if your product is seasonal in nature is it if your product is seasonal in nature for specified season for the specified season itself you will be doing production activity or you will be conducting production activity into your business okay okay what about the rest months of the year yes the machineries is it the machineries of your organization as well as the resources of your organization they will be yes they will be not employed is it they will not be used okay or they will not be functioning okay so considering this phase considering this phase you can invent something okay you can invent something in which you will be utilizing your resources you will employ your resources whole year okay you will employ your resources whole year okay so it will be helpful for you to tap the excessive capacity of your organization and utilize optimally utilize the resources of your organization is it then travel to new countries okay see this can also be a motive for the international business how okay to explore the new markets okay to sell your products in the new market whether it is feasible to sell your product in that new market okay for studying this for surveying it itself you will travel to new country is it right okay because unless until you physically go there and survey study whether it is feasible to market our product or not okay whether it is feasible to distribute our goods here or not okay whether we will be getting the expected sales okay Ex expected response from the customers or not okay for studying all these things yes you will visit that place okay so it can also be a motive for international business so uh, the 10 points which we have highlighted these are the 10 motives why a particular businessman can go or switch over towards international business or international market so with this we conclude today's lecture thank you